And we see the one car come up on the back of Buckshot and wow. Drove right through him. Yeah. Drove right through him. Right. Oh, boy. Listen, just listen to this as Buckshot gets the ball. Buckshot Jones loose in the two. Yeah, he was loose off of four. I, he took my breath wow. off of four. And I think he was having a problem long before this happened. Good thing Jeff Purvis's brakes were okay after that earlier wreck because Buckshot went right across in front of him. We did see the net come oh, down man. on Buckshot Jones's wow. car. Wow. Boy, Leffler just drove right up into the side of Buckshot. And watch this. Ooh, wow. And, oh, and it's not over. And the thing about Leffler's car, he already had damage, and that probably just didn't, the car probably took off on him, Larry. But you know what I like about the shot that Buckshot took? That's guardrail. It gives a little bit. That concrete don't move. At this point in time, now you're trying to get all your safety harnesses off, the belts, the, the hoses. You're encapsulated in this thing now. I mean, we found out the safety industry that you don't want to move at all in these race cars. Watch this car right here. Watch him turn. Up the hill, and buddy, she's not slowing down. Ooh, oh, that's a hard wow. lick. Looked like he got loose, Daryl, and corrected it back, and it just shot right up the hill into the outside wall. And there's Dave Marcus with nowhere to go, and Ricky Craven, Craven going all the way to the bottom. Squeezes by on the inside on the apron. Another car back here spins. Poor Marcus, if he had turned left, he would have turned right into another car, had nowhere to go. Heavy impact. So glad he had that Hans device on. No one car was the other car down there. Jason Leffler. Leffler. 